Hello, I'm Stuart Broadley. I'm CEO of the Energy Industries Council, also known as the EIC, and delighted once again to be working with uh, the Robert Gordon University Aberdeen Business School to develop again the EIC RGU Rising Star Award 2019, uh, and of course looking forward to the same award in 2020. EIC and RGU have been working together now for three years on the Rising Star Award. The Rising Star Award is really important to the EIC. Uh, our role is to help businesses, our member companies, to develop in the UK and around the world. And of course, this doesn't happen without amazing leadership. The Rising Star Award is all about looking for those future leaders. It's a mechanism by which we offer scholarships to talented candidates in the energy industry. It's highly competitive and we put the candidates through a rigorous application and interview process. So we partnered with the EIC to offer the MBA Rising Star to their membership organisations of over 700 companies. The interview process with uh, RGU is a pretty rigorous interview process um, and individuals that come through that process and ultimately win uh, have to meet uh, quite difficult goals of both uh, doing wonderful work in the business they're in already, working with teams and developing them, but also being future potential leaders and ambassadors for the industry. Uh, and that's why we were so delighted with Brian Geddes, uh, who's of course got a key role in PX Limited at St Fergus, um, and because he exemplified all of those uh, qualities. Hi, I'm Brian Geddes, the winner of the 2019 EIC RGU Rising Star Award. My day job is I work for PX Limited, supporting the St Fergus gas plant as the engineering manager. I have a team of 25 engineers that work for me, um, supporting a key bit of infrastructure that provides up to 25% of the UK's gas supply. I'd first like to thank PX Limited for nominating me for this award. Um, really proud that they saw the future potential in me to be a leader in the energy industry. Being the winner of the um, EIC RGU Rising Star Award at this stage of my career gives me an excellent opportunity. Studying the oil and gas MBA will allow me to develop my leadership skills, my critical and strategic thinking, and widen my industry contacts. Being able to study the MBA um, and also getting that link with the EIC is an excellent opportunity to grow my position within the industry. So the strategic thinking and the learnings from the MBA, coupled with the extended network that the EIC provide to over 700 companies, um, feels an excellent opportunity to develop me into a new leader in the energy industry. One of the things that you've now, um, you will be asked to do is also to talk to uh, others around uh, the energy industry, things like energy transition, but also just to represent, if you like, EIC and RGU, if you like, as a bit of an ambassador. Yep. Um, so how, kind of, how do you think is the best way for you to take that forward in terms of the, you know, you will get asked more often now to talk about the industry uh, and about the award? So yes, Jared, it's, uh, it's one of my passions really is kind of developing people. And I think it starts really young that, um, studying STEM subjects at school was one of that things. So um, I've been involved in some school visits um, to promote kind of STEM subjects um, and trying to get an uptake in the people studying STEM subjects. Um, and I think the the opportunity that we've got with the energy transition and what's happening is an opportunity for people. Um, it's an opportunity to use um, some different thinking, some different approaches, and that leaders may come from different places than the traditional kind of route of leaders within the industry. So I think a positivity around the energy industry as well. Um, sometimes we can suffer from being a little bit negative. So I think that positivity to try and attract the best people in, in the industry is important because if we are not attracting the best people, then the industry is going to stop developing at the pace that it's developed in, in the past when it may have been the most attractive industry to come into. So I think we really need to um, get that message out there that the energy industry is the place that the best caliber graduates and people want to be joining. The absolute challenge facing the energy industry right now is energy transition. And that's also a critical area that we look for when awarding the Rising Star are leaders who have the scope to take on board what is gonna be a key future challenge 
for UK and the world's energy industry, which is to steer us safely through energy transition.